<laughs> I'll be the one doing the haul this time. <laughs> it's empty. No, you can't control the channel. It will go down in a matter of seconds. Your videos will just be random. They won't even make any sense. It will just be all over the place. Okay, um, maybe we can talk about this. So, anyway, just hand them over and nobody will get hurt. Okay. No. I don't think we will. Ah. Shall we do a haul video? So now that beautiful intro is out of the way, let's actually get into the comics. The first one is Year of the Villain, Joker number one. This was the only edition that my comic book store had left. This is a one that is written by John Carpenter. If you don't know who John Carpenter is, he uh, directed the original and I think he wrote uh, Halloween, the original one. So anyway, if we flip the first blank page out, there's the actual cover, which is actually very nice. And then the back. The Joker Year of the Villain number one. Yep, Carpenter. Then just completely blank. Has a $4.99 cover price and it's rated T. So let's flip through the artwork. Uh, oh yeah, the advertising uh, Heroes in Crisis. I have not read that yet. I want to, but there's literally so much to read. So I'm literally doing my best to get to everything. Love that cover. Love how the ha ha ha's are. Lining up. I know this is a like a big thing that they're doing right now. Year of the villain and uh, Joker is just he's the best villain there is. So. <laughs> Of course, it's just biased because that's my opinion. <laughs> Next one is these were only about five bucks each. I found them in the bargain bin. They uh, include Batman and well, Batman Arkham, Two Face. It pretty much follows all of uh, Two Face's greatest stories throughout the years, going all the way up to um, Detective Comics to Modern, which is like 2014 for this, I believe. But that's some of the artwork. Yeah, you see a bit more modern there. I think that actually might be from Batman or Robin, but I'm not sure. The new 52 line, it could be wrong. So anyway, Batman Arkham Two-Face. Batman Arkham Two-Face. And it does have the older DC logos on it, so you know it's a bit older. So that is the cover, which is quite cool. Always, like, Two-Face's design is always, like, cool. It's always fascinated me. So that is the cover. That is the back. It's really cool, too. That's what it's about. Normally, it has a $19.99 cover price, but I got it for cheaper. That is the spine. Let's flip through it. Yep. You can see how his look... Oh, okay. <laughs> you can see how his look changed throughout the years. All the way back from Detective Comics. Next one is Batman Arkham Scarecrow. Perfect for the Halloween season. So anyway, that is the cover. And that is the back. And this is the same thing as uh, the Two-Face one. It just follows his greatest stories throughout the years. Here's something. Batman Arkham Scarecrow. So that is the cover. That is the spine, and that is the back. If you want to read what this one covers, let me get rid of the glare. There you go. And it has a 1999 cover price. Let's flip through it. Batman. So the next one is. The Flash Rebirth, Volume 2, Speed of Darkness. This is the second Flash volume that I own from the uh, Rebirth run. I own the first two volumes from uh, the New 52 as well. So anyway, that is the cover. 
The Flash Volume 2 Speed of Darkness. So that is the cover. There is the spine. Has a $14.99 cover price, which isn't terrible. And it collects issues 9 through 13. That's what it's about if you want to read the full one. Now let's flip through the art. Looking good. The next one is Batman Rebirth Volume 4 A War of Jokes and Riddles. And uh, this collects quite a few issues. So it's a bit more expensive, but probably one of the best panels in this is that. Batman DC Universe Rebirth Volume 4 The War of Jokes and Riddles. So there is the spine. Volume 4. There is the back, has a Riddler on it. Only fitting Riddler on the back, Joker on the front. Has a 1999 cover price because I believe it has more uh, issues than a normal one because it collects issues 25 through 32 and that's what this story is about if you want to read it. Let's flip through the auto work. Oh, got Killer Croc in there. That could be Scarecrow. I like the Joker's new look. I think it's quite cool. Joker, Joker. Batman Volume 3, I am Bane. So now I own Volumes 1 through 4 of Batman Rebirth. And the art on the back of this is just great. <laughs> so next is Batman Volume 3, I am Bane, because we're doing this out of order. Really love the artwork on Bane. I think he looks really cool. Has a $16.99 cover price. And it collects Batman 16 through 20, 23, and 24. And Batman Annual number 1. Now it's missing a few issues. And that's because I believe uh, the button is in between that. Great artwork on the front too. Not a surprise, the artwork on the inside looks just as good. We've got Batman, the man who laughs. Have not read it yet, but I'm looking forward to jumping into it. Ha ha! Batman, the man who laughs. So there is the front with that lovely iconic Joker pose. Which I believe they actually got from a silent movie, I think, called The Laughing Man or something like that. So that's that. And that is the spine. There is the back. Stop it! You're killing me, Batsy. I don't know if he says that, but I just decided to say it. It has a $14.99 cover price, and that's what it's about if you want to read it. There we go. Read it like Star Wars. one is the last two volumes I needed inside uh, the New 52 verse for the Nightwing series and that is volume 4 Second City Nightwing volume 4 Second City so that is the front the spine that's volume 4 yeah. that is the back collects issues 19 through 24 and it has a $14.99 cover price let's flip through it was volume 5 setting sun nightwing volume 5 setting sun this is the last volume in the uh, nightwing run so there is the back it has a $16.99 cover price because it was probably the last one so they decided to <laughs> and there is the art to work And also from DC Black Label, I'm not sure if I showed this in the last video, so I'll just show it again. I got Harleen Book One. And I uh, this is the last cover left, and I like this cover the best, so I went right for it. 
This I'm looking forward to jumping into. I have not had the chance to read this yet, but I'm looking very forward to it. So next is Harleen, book one by... I'll butcher that if I even tried to stay, say it. <laughs> so that is the front. That is the back. I've heard very good things about this one, so I'm looking forward to jumping into it. I love how the black labels for most of the time are like these big magazines. Joker, Harley, Criminal, Insanity. And I have read through this one, and this is this was quite a surprise. It was better than what I expected. It was different than what I expected. And I'll do a full video on uh, this storyline because it's actually quite cool. This is only the first one of, I believe, a nine or eight issue series. So, very curious to see where it goes. Mm hmm. This is also black label. And the cool thing about this, the present time is in black and white, and the flashbacks are in color, which I'll show you right now. Yet yeah, they talk about Ted Bundy. See, look. Uh, see, that's a flashback, and it's in color. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And to subscribe so I know to keep making more of these. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching and bye.